Yeah, what's up, y'all? I'm JB Black CEO, and welcome to Barbershop Talk TV. We all know, you know what I'm saying, what went down with the Sweetie Pies, the court, the trial, Tim, Andre, so on and so on. And we also seen the court transcripts. <clears throat> Excuse me. We saw the court transcripts. Miss Robbie tried to create generational wealth, you know, for the family, from what I see. Um, is families perfect? No. I got a question. Um, I see some people down in the comment section, which is cool. I'm just asking a question. Did Miss Robbie know anything what Tim was doing? Did she see anything was wrong? What's your opinion? Please don't attack me. I'm just trying to see, you know, because it is an interest, interesting case. You know, was she slapped in the face? Boom, all this new. Damn, my son, what? Tim, what are you doing? What are you doing, Tim? Or, yeah, come on back. My house was uh, broken into, Andre. Come back. As we seen, you know, the text messages or the messages and the, the com conversation and the communications that Dre had with his grandmother, that right there then sit right with a lot of people. On that note, was Miss Robbie just mad at uh, Andre? Because as we see, both of them wanted the brother to come back and take this um, polygraph test. We seen them say fences. Um, you, you know, we seen the actions. We seen Tim. We're not finna get in that yet. But but the sister Miss Robbie, mad respect, you know. But something don't look right. You got people that's upset. You got some people that's supporting. Them. I'm just asking a question. Do y'all think she knew something? Do y'all think she knew her son was upset? I mean, because just think. Now, I'm gonna be upset. Somebody breaking in my mom's house. I'm gonna be upset if it's a cousin. I'm gonna be upset if it's a nephew. I'm gonna be upset. Forrest taking a life. I can't see that. Now, putting hands on him, uh, it's a great possibility. And I understand this brother was upset. And Miss Robbie is upset. If your house was broken into over two hundred fifty thousand dollars or a million dollars, allegedly, however, and so when you have that right there, and then you look at the text messages, the court transcripts, uh, come back Dre, and all of this and all of that, somewhere in there, you know, people be violated, pissed off, upset, mad. I don't care if your grandma, auntie, cousin, or whatever. What do you think? Did y'all think Miss Robbie, you know, kind of seen something or didn't think it was going to go this far or whatever? You know, because we, us sons, we'll tell our moms, you don't like that. Yo, don't mess with moms. I don't play that. And moms know when us boys is upset. A lot of moms know when we finish to put it down. Moms know. They know our boys. They know us. They know the boys. What do you think about the sister, Miss Robbie? Hey, don't attack me. I'm just putting a question out there. I seen in the comment section where people saying, hey, Robbie did not know nothing. Robbie, Tim, and didn't know Blase Blase. Then you see the people say, hey, she had to know something. Miss Robbie is evil, or this and this and that. I didn't say it. I'm looking at the public, the community, across this country, across America. But listen, if you're new here at Barbershop TV, make sure you subscribe, hit like, hit that notification button so when I go live, guess what? I'm going to bring you the truth off gate. So hit that notification button so you get the notification when I go live or upload a video here at Barbershop Talk TV. Check it out. Wait for the uh, some of the people that I'm gonna bring on and we're gonna analyze different things like this about life entertainment, the whole nine here at Barbershop Talk TV. Make sure you subscribe so we can grow and we can get to those thousand subscribers. Okay, my question is, did Miss Robbie know anything? I know that hurt people. Oh, he's saying it. Oh, he said it again. No, I ain't trying to hurt your feelings. But when you look at this case, the transcripts, just the transcripts, I ain't going to go back all through it. But look at the transcripts. Besides, um, you know, your, your, your actual feelings and what you think. It's okay to look at the transcripts and say, hey, uh, you know, wazze, wazze, boonza, boonza. But to me, it don't sound right and it don't look. When I look at the transcripts, what uh, Tim was saying, uh, the information that was coming out, listening to the Griggs family speak on it, how Andre was, uh, you know, living, the living conditions. I thought that was disgusting and awful. 
like for real this guy wasn't having uh he, he he didn't have an apartment or something been renovated or a condo no little refrigerator little microwave okay he's a young man and i get it but when the other auntie come to visit him it didn't look right jealousy envy is what this brother had to deal with andre rest in peace do you think miss robbie knew more than what she knew do you think she knew tim would take it to another level as i see i can tell miss robbie don't have a good i don't know maybe they don't have a good relationship with the grids where her sons uh with andre's mother rest in peace to dre's father her son tim's bro rest in peace to him ain't that sad ain't that sad brother get jammed up and setting up your son taking his life or having his life taken over what over what who did it who did it then do you think miss robbie seen this guy have a temper did she i mean come on now. i'm just saying tim when did this guy to come back miss robbie wanted him to come back to st louis when i look at that right there it's like wow that's some come back so we can straighten you it's almost like bro, i'm gonna go upside your head and then on top of that you know you got over two hundred fifty thousand dollars worth of merchandise or items that was stolen that right there by itself will make me pause especially if I know I didn't do it. Listen to the family. The way Dre responded. I didn't do it, Grandma. I did not do it. That was Tim. This brother said it was Tim. His voice still speak from the grave from what I see. It was Tim. I don't know who it was. I wasn't there. But I think it's crazy that when I sit back and look at this and we analyze it, break it down, look at the court transcripts, reminisce from looking at the show, Looking at some of the show clippings. Damn. Damn did snap on. Damn, okay, Andre then was Young Bucks. But it's Young Bucks. You don't have to whoop them. You don't have to discipline them. The jealousy, the envy. What in the hell happened up there in St. Louis? I don't know. But my question. They miss Robbie, you know, know anything. Like, damn, Tim might, you know, cause my mom knew when I get a little upset. My grandmother knew when I get upset. They knew when the boys get upset. Then you had these families, boy, hey, some of these boys go out there and get it done. They get it done. Fight the neighbor, they got up the street, and the mom knew it. Some of these moms say, yeah, boy, my boy go out there and jump on you. You know, I have to watch him. You know, do she know her son? Did she know him? And you know, sometimes mothers don't tell us everything, so we won't snap. So we won't snap. What did Miss Robbie know? I don't know. Please don't come after me. I'm just asking a simple question. Two weeks, three weeks later, after the verdict of the brother Tim Norman. Tim is now the department, um, he is now property of the Department of Corrections. Flip-flops, whatever, inmate number. Yeah, I hate it. And I also hate that Andre lost his life. I'm gonna get up out of here. Please subscribe, hit like, join Barbershop Talk TV out here in America with us. That way we can hang out, get each other's opinion, drop this link one day, you come on and let me know what you think. Did Miss Robbie see anything, feel anything? Cause parents, these moms be knowing about their boys. It's just what I'm asking. A lot of people say, no, she didn't, Jay. And you don't need to ask that, hey, it's just the First Amendment where I'm just trying to figure out and just see what is the community's take on it. If you're from St. Louis, let me know. If you're from surrounding areas, let me know. If you've been up there, hey, you know them. Hey, I'm the, well, actually, no, I'm not finna try to call out people that know. But just throwing it out there, though. What do you think? Do you think Miss Robbie kind of knew something? Do you think she know her son? Some people say, yes, yeah, she know him. Some people say, no, she didn't know him. She didn't know it. None of this. All this stuff that happened, Miss Robbie didn't know. I don't know. But one thing I do know is those court transcripts, the information that came out in court, wow, it was sad. All I seen was anger and no protection. Anger, 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 and no protection. From one side of the family to the next. Mm, let me know what you think. 
Other than that, I'm out. You need a haircut? Get your ass here before six. Other than that, take care of yourself. Take care of others. One.